Hello, this is Haku the Bean, and I have finally made it to level 8 of the back rooms. This place is pretty dangerous, so I'll try and be quick with reading. By the way, if you liked the video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. And no, there will never be any consistency with the, the order that I say those things in. Anyway, level 8 is Survival Difficulty Class 5. It is unsafe, unsecure, and is infested with entities. Level 8 is the ninth level of the back rooms. <sighs> level 8 is an expansive cave system. Infamous for the numerous spire-like entities which inhabit it. Only a few light sources can be found randomly throughout the ceilings of these caves. Though these two will go dark after only a few minutes of exposure, making exploration of this level extremely difficult and dangerous. In addition to the low visibility, loud sounds are known to echo through the level and attract large swarms of spiders to the source. The majority of this level is cramped and filled with jagged stalagmites and stalactites that make linear progress impossible. Though some larger cave systems have been documented deep within that, that could serve as outpost locations of the future. Other areas of interest have been documented, though many remain an unknown secret to the majority of wanderers. <sighs> Colonies and Outposts World Eaters Due to 8 being a Karn's sacred number, the rogue world eaters set up base at level 8. They maintain control control over the caverns and will shoot on sight. Even the entities that dwell within the caves are afraid of them. So avoid at all costs. Backroom Colonists the outpost contains around 37 guards and is mostly for transportation. It is the final level of the fa of the main in nine colonized by the group, and they will help wanderers leave the level. Entities Level 8 is inhabited by a lot of different species of spiders. Explorers can find all the way from them small brown and venomous spiders to king spiders, while some of them rely on their and nests and on their venom to survive, other species don't have venom and generally are just members of their nest. Always advise to avoid every form of life present on the level. There's many nests that spiders made, most inhabited by small venomous spiders and massive king and queen spiders. The king spiders of these colonies are fortunately not venomous, but the queen spiders are highly venomous. Most die within minutes of a queen spider or bite, though this is just speculation as human exploration of this level is currently impossible. Caveling Spiders Death Pools Large clear pools can be found in dead end ca in dead ends of, of the cave. These pools are highly dangerous, as as anything that enters them gets torn apart and dragged down by humanoid tarbat Back hands. Another type of nest found at level 8 houses Franken Spires, a dangerous mutated spire that regenerates through oh, a gland found on, on its, in its chest cavity. Certain areas of the cave have what is presumed to be drum and almond water dripping from these lactites on the ceiling. So I wouldn't recommend it and testing that theory out. <sighs> Entrances. Look for a hole in level 6 or at the bottom of the water in level 7. The most common way to enter this level is by finding entrances through level 7, but there are numerous entrances as throughout other levels of the back rooms. Exits. Trip or fall and you will get transported to level 9, but you will also have an extremely low chance to be transported to level 153. All the reported cases who got out of level 8 this way were by accident, so it's not certain whether falling intentionally will work or not. If you found a black doll, play with it for a while to be transported to level 7453. <sighs> well, should I 
Try and trip and fall, or should I I play with a black doll? Maybe you should vote out on this video. Or maybe I'll just decide it later. Anyway, that was level 8 of the back rooms. This is going to be a hard one to move on from, but I'll try. Chances are, I might just trip and fall into level 9 anyway. If I do end up doing so, or if I end up finding a doll to play with it's until I'm on the other level that they mentioned, I'll see you in the next one. Hmm. Hmm. I guess if you liked the video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you next time with another video about something regarding anomalies. Whether it be weird places like the back rooms or SCPs. Since I got the first nine out of the way, I am free to move around the, the backgrounds levels as freely as I am to move around random SCP entries now. I hope you enjoy. Bye.